going on guys, Static here, and welcome back to Black Aperture for another episode of Spawn Point, the show where we test which blocks mobs can and can't spawn on, simply because we can. Now, before we get started today's episode, I just wanted to give a really quick shout out to my little brother for lending me his headset while mine's out of commission. Thanks heaps for that, mate. Um, and so today I thought we'd do a block that you guys have been asking me to do for quite a while now, and that is Soul Sand. Okay, so that's all pads except for our usual control pad filled in with Soul Sand. And so the most common reason that people wanted to see Soul Sand tested was uh, that they said Soul Sand is not a complete block, it's something like 15 sixteenths of a full block, and so they weren't 100% sure whether that would uh, constitute a full block, like a stone brick block for example, or a half block, or not a complete block, like uh, a half slab for example. So uh, they weren't sure whether that would allow spawns or not. So, let's uh, flick off the lights and see what happens. Okay, and you can see very quickly we get spawns up on that back pad over there, and a single solitary zombie over that side. Uh, so that's conclusive proof that mobs can indeed spawn on top of soul sand. Now, keep in mind guys, this may not have always been the case. Uh, as you can see here, soul sand is now a complete block. It matches up perfectly with the stone brick uh, block to the right here. Both the uh, hitbox and the block itself match up perfectly. Whatever the case though, as far as we're concerned, soul sand will go into our spawnable box along with half slabs or double half slabs, wool, mushrooms, pressure plates, nether rack, fence gates, furnaces, crafting tables, redstone lamps and mycelium. Okay, so if there's a uh, block up on the wall that you'd particularly like to see tested, feel free to let me know in the comments section down below. If it gets enough interest, we'll test that in a future episode. Also, if there's a block you'd like to see tested that's not up on the wall, again, feel free to suggest that in the comments section down below. And if it gets enough interest, and I think it'll be an interesting test, we'll test it in a future episode. Anyway guys, I hope you've enjoyed today's episode. If you have, please feel free to show that like button some love. It helps me out more than you may realise. I've been Static, and I'll see you guys next time.